What about the data? I know that's what some of you are wondering. Okay, we hear all these great projects, but what about the data? So let me talk about the data. Yellow Springs Schools in 2013 was named, our high school was named the best high school, to the best high schools list for the US News and World Reports, a silver award winner for the first time ever in our school's history. Then in 2015, we were named to the best high schools list again as a silver award winner for the second time in our school's history. Then in 2016, <laughs> we, were we were named to the best high schools list. Thank you. Thanks to the students. For the third time in our school's history in four years, and the third time ever, we were gold award winners this time, and we were ranked as the highest school district in the entire uh, Miami Valley Dayton region, which is a huge jump for us, especially if you know some of the schools around us that are incredible schools and have done very well on, on tr traditional standardized assessments. Uh, we were very proud of this. Our graduation rate for 2015 was 100%. It's going to show up on this report card. Our graduation rate for 2016, we think, is 100%. But if you've ever seen the math formula, it's a little wild and crazy. And we're hoping that we'll get to 100%. But right now, it looks like it's going to be 100% two years in a row, uh, which is a testament to the work we're doing, to our teachers, to our principals, and uh, really the work we're doing with PBL, I think. Uh, our teachers have been asked to take a survey from an A to F ranking scale. And here is our teachers actually last year rating project-based learning as an instructional approach. And so some people may think, well, he's saying this, but how do his teachers really feel about the work? And so I think you can see here that the great majority of our teachers are very supportive of the work and supportive of what we're doing with PBL. Now, clearly, we have uh, about 5% of our staff that's not particularly pleased with the work, but I think we can count those in Yellow Springs on one hand, and I think that's a really powerful testament to the work we've been doing collectively as a team.